people of YouTube, welcome to my channel, it's Shauna OK, aka Little Bit of Sunshine, hoping to brighten up your day no matter what the weather. And today I'm going to do a shopping haul, I went to Blanchard Town in Dublin um, about a week ago now, but I've been putting off this video a little bit because I'm not well as you can probably hear, but oh well, like I'm just going to have to get on with it because if I was waiting until I was better, um, I'd probably never ever do a video again, so let's get on to it, right? The first, I'm going to like leave my pennies and Primark stuff to the end because like I feel like most people would have clicked on to see that stuff but like let's save them things to the end Um, the first shop I went into it was called Sauce and Green and I don't really know how to explain this shop I think you just have to walk into it because they kind of do bits of everything they do like householdy stuff, they do crafts, they do like snacky food kind of stuff and like just like general household stuff but I went in to get paintbrushes um, it's incredibly cheap, that's why I went, like, I went, I was looking for paintbrushes and I went into it and this packet was only 127, or 123 and this one was 180 so like as I say, 12 paintbrushes for like literally less than 4 euro, absolute bargain and in it I also actually got the bag that I have everything in which is like a unicorn bag which I think is literally so adorable I have another version of this, they do like different versions of reusable bags so they'd have maybe the same pattern but they'd do it in like three or four different shapes so I have like a smaller version of it with a zip on it as well but this big huge one here was let's see only 181 and it was just that because I didn't want to get the same one as my mom I got this one in the bigger version so they're really good and really you should check them out like that's all I got today but there's literally times I walk out with like so much and like do I have things in it that literally cost like 82 cent or 20 cent actually that reminds me I got something else in it that it's gone missing in my bag of course it is dear dear I got a packet of five pencils for 79 cent 79 cent for five pencils I'm with rubbers on them too and they're kind of cute like and they loads of different designs and all it's great for like kids stationery and all as well like literally, you just you just have to walk into the shop. Like I can't explain it any better to you than you have to walk in. My mum was explaining to me, and I was like, "All right, yes, Adrian, whatever." But when I walked in, I was like, "Oh my god, this shop is actually amazing!" <laughs> so now every time I go over, I'm like, "Can we go to Sustreen? Sustreen Green? I don't really know how to say. It. I will literally write it here so that like you can like find it yourselves." But if you are if you still live in Dublin or near Blanchard Town or whatever, if you want to actually go to the shop, it's downstairs beside Dunn's downstairs if that makes sense so the four shop to the left beside Dunn's downstairs so yeah check it out the next shop I went into it was kind of another little bit of a craft shop kind of similar to Saskia and Graham it's Flying Tiger Copenhagen it used to call just be called Tiger here but now it's called Flying Tiger Copenhagen and I went in just to have a look I guess and I got this little like pin set that you like for sewing yeah and you can just like pins up here and all and this was only two euro which I thought was really good because like I am always jabbing the pins into my clothes when I'm sewing <laughs> so to keep them like in order so I was like this is definitely going to be like one of the best sewing investments I ever make so that was only two euro so yeah and then I got this washi tape and that was only a euro for the two of them and I was like that's really good because I was only literally looking at this these exact ones on AliExpress and they were like 78 cents each which isn't dear either but when I saw two for one euro I was kind of like damn that's good so I got a packet of them too and then the next shop I went into it was Claire's Accessories and Claire's have a bit of a deal on at the minute I don't know if they'll still have the deal on when I, put, when I have this video up but they've had it on for a while so they might and anyway deal or oh, deals no Clears always have really good deals on anyway, that's what I was trying to say. <laughs> and um, but the minute their bag their deal is buy three, get three free. So when I heard that I was like, right, I kinda need new bobbins and I only really like the bobbins out of clears because I find them like really good quality compared to like Penny's ones or whatever. And I like the ones with like no metal in them, so clears are really good for them. And I bought like two or three packets when I was in like my first year of college and I still have some of them bobbins and as a girl if like any girl watching will understand that is actually incredible to still own bobbins I still own like maybe seven bobbins out of the original packet and they're only like ten in a pack so to like have seven out of twenty after five or six years is literally a miracle but like they are starting to break as you can probably see so I was like better get some new ones so I got all six packets 
the missing packet. There we go. All the six packets for seven seven fifty. They were two fifty each, so I got yeah, they should have been 14 euro, but I got them for 750. Yeah, no, I should, they should have been 15 euro, but I got them for 750. I'll get there eventually. So I worked out about 125 a packet. So I basically just got all black ones except one packet of colourful ones because my mum was giving out. She was like, hey, you're buying all black ones. And I was like, fine, I'll buy a packet of coloured ones. So I have a packet of coloured ones, which we'll probably get never get yours. So, Adrian, I'm blaming you. Uh, <laughs> I know it's a really good deal and I highly highly recommend them if you have long hair if you have thick hair like literally these are amazing absolutely incredible bobbins maybe I should hold them the right way around but I definitely even if you don't have long hair I recommend the non metal ones because the metal ones like get caught in your hair and it's not a good scene so non metal ones are the best for your hair 100% I stand by that statement 100% so Six packets for 750 out of clears, like that was like, literally incredible to me. I was like, stocking up there. <laughs> As you can see, I haven't even opened them yet. Like, my mum was like, hmm. I was looking for a bobbin last night. She's like, Johnny, you literally bought like a million bobbins today. Where are they? And I was like, I haven't opened them yet. And she was laughing at me. She's like, Why haven't you? And I was like, Because the other ones are still alive. And she was like, Oh my god. But I probably will end up opening them, opening them this week because, like, I'll definitely like end up snapping these ones. They're literally on the last limbs. Except this one actually. This one's kind of still perfect. But you know yourself, you can never depend on one bobbin. That that's when it all falls apart. Okay, so the next part is my penny stuff. And usually when I go into pennies, I come out with maybe one thing, two thing, or none. Like I've like when I was younger I used to love pennies, but as I got a bit older, I don't know. It didn't appeal to me as much. Not that like the stuff wasn't nice or the stuff wasn't good or anything like that, but it just wasn't like me. So I went in to date my mum and I was like literally saying to myself, walking in, I was like, I'm gonna come out with empty handed, I know I am. And I didn't. <laughs> I was really shocked. I got loads for once and I was like, yay me! So anyway, let's get on to it. First thing, the thing I always come out of pennies with, believe it or not, well not always, but nine out of ten times I will come out of pennies with. This is usually what I go to pennies for, is socks. But I usually go for white socks, but lately that I've found that like my white socks keep going missing. So I bought coloured ones so that it's easier to match them and I'd be less likely to lose them. So these two packets were two euro each. So ten pairs of socks for two euro. Absolutely for well no, ten pairs of socks for four euro two five pairs of socks for two euro, that's what I meant to say. That <laughs> mix that up there. Well done, Sean it. So yeah, and they're just like nice little cutie colours. These are these ones are definitely my favourite compared to the other ones. The other ones will just be more for like maybe going to the gym or whatever. But these ones are like really cute. They've little love hearts on them and stripes and then love hearts again and then stripes again and then love hearts again. So literally so adorable and I can't wait to wear them. I don't know why I haven't been wearing them already, but I will see no doubt. No doubt I'll probably turn the camera off and put a pair of them on me now. I'm gonna be like, ooh socks. <laughs> So that was the first thing I got. The second thing I got was this cute little hat. And I'm not the biggest fan of hats, but this like autumn, like it's only at the beginning of October. The past few days I have been freezing and I said to my mum, I was like, this this winter is gonna be really cold. I can feel it in my bones. Like I was like, yeah, you're probably right. And I was like, right, I'm gonna purchase a hat. <laughs> and she was like, you don't wear hats. I was like, I know I don't, but we're gonna change that. So I bought this little hat and it's just plain and simple, nothing fancy and a little four ball on the top of it. A fake four ball, I hope. Well, it's from pennies, it's definitely fake four. <laughs> Real four balls in there, uh, pennies now. And this was only three euro. So like, and as I say, it's very very small, so I'll go with a lot of things, that's what I kind of went with. I was going to go with like, colours as such, if that makes sense, like buying like a wine one and buying like a purple one and a blue one and all that kind of crap, and then I was kind of like, no, I'll end up having to buy like 20 hats just to match my outfits. So I just went with this really neutral coloured one, and I think it looks hella cute on me. Well, you may not agree, but I think it does, so yeah, you can the hat. If you see me in the future outside and I don't have my hat on me, give out to me so I start wearing it. <laughs> the next thing I got was actually like in the sale and it was this face mask. I did a face mask review on this channel like about a week ago, a week and a half ago and I wanted to do another one from Penny's and this stuff was 3 50 and it was reduced to 1 euro so I was like that'll make a good video. So I literally only bought it for YouTube so <laughs> I probably will use it once and never use it again, so see how it happens. 
Um, yeah, fun your world. So, always check the bargain rack. Everyone always laughs at me when I say that, but literally, always check the bargain rack. Absolutely amazing. I got more stuff on the bargain rack, but I'll come to that in a minute. Um, the next thing I got was probably like one of my favourite purchases of the day, and it was this hoodie, and it says, I am a girl, what is your superpower? And I really love this because lately I don't know what it is, but lately I've been feeling the real feminist in my ways. That like I'm really angry at men all of a sudden. <laughs> don't ask why. <laughs> but um, I am, I feel like, I don't know, maybe this statement isn't going to be taken too well, but I feel like men get an easier way in this world. That like things seem to be handed to them a little bit easier than it's handed to a woman. And that's just my own personal feelings at the moment. It may pass, it may not. But... At the minute, <laughs> this, I thought this was really good for how I was feeling about that. I was like, you know, I'm a girl. What's your superpower? I do think it's a superpower to become a girl. To become a girl? Well, people can become girls, so I don't know why I say it. Anyway, <laughs> before I ramble off there and get annoyed at myself for rambling off, this was only €6 Euro, and it's actually quite good quality. Like, it's not really thin or anything like that. So, absolute bargain. When I seen this, I was like, damn, that's only €6. Euro. I would have paid double that for that. And I have paid like double and triple that for jumpers like this, so yep. The next thing I got was on the bargain rack, as per usual. Shauna loves a bargain. And it was this like bodysuit that's in like a dusty rosy kind of pink. And this was only three euro and I was like, what? That can't be right. And I looked again and like they had loads of sizes in it as well. And I was like, what the hell? Why aren't people liking this? I love this, I love this colour lately. Kind of blushy, dusty pink kind of colour. So I was like, literally, this was made for me, and it was reduced from 10 euro to 3 euro. I was like, what? So, absolutely had to keep it up. Only thing, like, I can say is, I'm a bit afraid of the material because it's that kind of like, I'm gonna call it clingy material, and I hate this as a girl that has even, like, that has curves. I really hate, like, this kind of material, and but I'm going to brave it and see what it's like when I try it on and hopefully it's nice and I can just tuck it into a pair of jeans and wear it on a night out or wear it even just going somewhere that's like even remotely fancy or somewhat casual. I don't know. But I really love it and I really hope it looks nice on. <laughs> really. Pray for Sean. Seriously. The next thing I got was on the bag rack as well. Seriously. Check out these bag racks. And it was this lovely like woolen jumper that has like the choker style on it. And it's in a lavender, and that's probably the only reason I liked it because it was lavender. I'm really loving dusty pink and lavender at the minute. So when I saw this, I was like, ew, that's cute. And then I noticed it was on the bargain rack, and I was like, wait, what? And this was reduced from 14 euro to 5 euro. And I was like, what? Because I'm wrong with it. It's actually like really cute. And they were like, I couldn't understand what it was. And when they had it in my size, I was like, this is meant to be. So I picked this up, and this is going to be super good because it is. Freaking freezing at the minute. I am going out later tonight, and do you know what? I will probably have this on me going out later tonight. I'll either have this one on me or the jumper I just showed you. So, <laughs> it's li like, I'll get words out eventually. I live in Ireland, so it's really cold at the minute, and it's only October, which is really sad because I'm literally dreading the fact that, like, it's gonna be winter, like, really soon, like, in a few weeks, and it's gonna get colder because it's literally, like, freezing at the minute. So I'm preparing with all my winter clothes this year. Last year I didn't buy much winter clothes and I regret it completely. So this year I'm coming in prepared to winter. So the next thing I got was this little basic top. It has like little moons and planets all over it and little tiny stars and all. And I thought this was really, really cute. I, I love a basic tea. I love a nice basic tea. But I found it really hard to come by lately. This was only three euro, which I thought was really funny because they're actual basic t-shirts that have nothing printed on them were three fifty, and I was like, that's cuter than that. It's only three euro, and I was really sad that they only had like these prints in it because I was like, if they had like other prints in it, I would have picked them up too. This is the only one they really had, and I was like, oh, because like literally so cute, and like it can go so well with so many things, and it's so like can imagine it's so comfy because it can feel the material, and that kind of material that's really like soft and really nice to wear. So absolutely so excited with this. <laughs> Just said three euro, like absolutely absolutely. Absolute and then the last thing I got in pennies, which is the last thing for the haul, so everybody be sad. <laughs> was another heart jumper and it was this purple one and it says sleep a, sleep a lot what's sleep sleep a lot eat a lot dream a lot and I really liked it because it said dream a lot because I, like I believe in dreams and dreaming 
and you know following your dreams and chasing your dreams so when I said that I was like ah that's kind of cute and again it was only six euro same as the other grey one so yeah can't wait to like wear this in the winter so I'm gonna try all these on for you for the first time ever <laughs> so let's get to it so this is the first t-shirt I think it's really cute on as I expected it would be so I'm not too mad about it um, 3 euro, absolute bargain and it's really light and really comfy as well so I can imagine myself wearing this quite a bit and I'm super impressed with it, <laughs> like literally I'm just like oh, I can't wait to wear this um, sorry if I keep touching my nose by the way it's like I'm not feeling the best so like my nose is kind of at me so but yeah I'm kind of loving it so let's try the next one shall we and this is the second one this is just a jumper um, I'm not loving it as much as I did when I bought it. Um, it's a lot baggier and a lot looser than I thought it would be, which like is kind of annoying me. But um, I'm not one for fitted stuff. I really am. I really do love loose stuff, but this one just seems a little bit too loose. I don't know what it is. But um, no, it's it's not as warm as I thought either. It's actually a lot lighter than I thought it was going to be, so I'm a little bit like annoyed with that. But like, same time, it's like it, it'll do. Like and like because it's so baggy, maybe I'll fit like more clothes underneath it when it's really cold. Like, Thicker jump, or like thick jump, like another jump button underneath it, or whatever, when it's cold. So, like, it'll probably be very a practical outfit, but for like actually wearing it, I don't really, I'm not, no, I will wear it. Like, there's no line about I will. I'll have it on me tomorrow or tonight, but it's not as great as I initially thought it was. For Situra, I'm not gonna complain, so <laughs> I really like it. Like, it says sleep a lot, eat a lot, and dream a lot. I, I love that, and I love the fact that, like, eat a lot has a love heart on it because, like, I love food. So, and this is the jumper. Um, I'm kind of loving it. <laughs> I did like when this first style, this style first came out. I was like, "What is the point of that? Like, literally, that you must be freezing in that." But now, like now that I think of it, like I've never been cold here, so like I kind of get it, and it kind of looks really cute. The only thing was, it was very hard to get over my head. I have a fat head. It looked like like this for a good five minutes. So you know, double match. It can be a headband too. But um, no, it's really nice and I love the colour of it. I absolutely love the colour of it. Like the lavender and I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just because I'm dark hair and I love lavender on myself. Love myself. Uh, no, but like everyone definitely has colours that they prefer on themselves. And at the minute, that colour to me is like lavender and like obviously black. Black is like my life, so I always wear a lot of black. <laughs> black is the colour of my soul. But um, now I actually really love this. I'm so glad I picked this up now. Because I wasn't going to, my mum didn't like it and she's like, no, that's rotten. And I was like, no, I like it, so I'm going to buy it. And I'm glad I did now. I'm glad I didn't listen to her. Again, it's a little bit on the baggy side. Maybe I'm like overestimating like my size. But um, no, it's quite, it's nice and like again as with the other jumper it just means I can put like more clothes underneath it or whatever and that like do you know what more material you'll be more warm <laughs> that's what I'm going with today so next one I have no idea what that was either like trying to work on camera tricks here <laughs> me yeah I know technological absolute ages trying to do this but you know and I I know I'm looking at my flip screen it's just so I know that I'm in the actual like shot so give out to me for that give out to me oh I'm looking at it now hi Shawnee <laughs> but um absolutely loving this jumper it's actually a little bit thicker than the purple one so loving it absolutely more and will probably wear it out tonight either this or the light purple one is going on my body tonight <laughs> But um, no, I absolutely love it. It's, it's really warm and like it's it's a little bit baggy as well. Again, with like all the other stuff, I just need to I need to like trust myself in life and go a size down. But um, then when I go a size down, they don't fit me. The f it's so irritating. But um, no, I'm gonna. What I might start doing is actually trying clothes on in shops. I don't do that for some reason, and I really need to start. Clearly, I'm not buying fit clothes for myself. But um, no, it's like. Cute. <laughs> I love it. I think every girl should get this t-shirt and we should all just go around Dublin in them together and show her absolute like what's the word? <laughs> allegiance as women. That's what I meant to say. Allegiance as women. Yeah, no. 
super cute, loving it. Definitely gonna wear this out this summer. Oh, this summer, Charlotte, it's it's autumn now. Get it through to your head. But um, no, definitely gonna wear this out. This is going to be like falling apart by the end of the winter. Like literally going to be falling apart. So um, yeah, loving it. Phew, on to the last item. Oh no, and it's that dusty pink bodysuit that Shauna doesn't know whether it's gonna fit her or not. Will she show it to you? Will she hate it that much that she's not gonna show it to you? Who knows? Okay, please excuse my bra. I'm not changing bras just for the, like the video, but um, mainly because I have no idea where all my strapless bras are because I put them away for the winter. But I um, absolutely love this on. Oh my God, was not expecting it to fit so well either. But um, it's actually <laughs> on the baggy side. Again, I should have gone a smaller size, but I didn't. But um, no, I actually love it. Like I can imagine myself like tucking it into a pair of jeans or a pair of leggings or whatever and just like absolutely rocking it. I can just see that now and like absolutely loving it. So the only thing is like the bottom of it is a bit on the like loose side because like it's a size a little bit too big on me. But um I am one of the persons that do not understand why people really tie them at the bottom anyway. So I probably won't because like I literally go to try it like six billion nights on uh, six billion nights. Six billion times a night, especially on a night out. I'm that person that's always in the toilet on a night out. So like I don't think I would like actually fasten it. <laughs> or if I did it'd literally be fasting for maybe the first hour and then after that it'd be gone. No. It'd probably be like hanging out with jeans and everything. But um no, it's actually like super nice and super flattering. Like like when it first came in I couldn't understand why women wanted to wear them, but now I kinda get I kinda get. But again, I wish I'd gone a size smaller. Oh gosh. It's not even like holding my boobies right. I'm gonna have to like pin it into a bra. So it'll actually like stay on me, but I do actually love it, so it's a win for me. Boop, 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 boop. So that's the end of this video. I hope you've enjoyed it and if you did give it a big thumbs up, you know, the usual crap, subscribe, blah 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 blah. Comment below, interact with me a little bit. Come on, I'm a nice girl. Sometimes. <laughs> um thank you for watching and see you all again soon.